Hey everyone, welcome to Alchemy Stars and we are here to kind of compare and uh, put to bed uh, who is actually better hero, either Arya or um, the last one is going to be Barton Deathblaze, the new one that just came out. So I'm going to be showcasing them each, um, trying to see what damage they do uh, versus a certain boss. And um, the only difference with this test is going to be they're going. Uh, each of them is going to be accompanied by a uh, by two converters. The same converters, same route, more or less. Um, only dealing damage uh, with only one tile to the boss to at least narrow down um, all of the damage that they can that they can do. So we're gonna be starting with um, hero. I did a pre-recording of this already and uh, Let's see how this goes Okay, so while um, we are doing this I'm gonna be fast forwarding this to some of uh, where the the sequence basically for each test is uh, doing active skill for Sikare and um, doing active skill for Pack. That's it. And um, going through the same route and dealing only one damage to this one, this specific tile. So we're going to be seeing um, the amount of normal attack that uh, Hero deals and all three of them and also the chain combo that they deal at max damage. Okay, or max chain combo damage. So as you can see here, let's. Uh, so there you go, seven thousand. So let's go back a bit and uh, see the damage of hero. That is one big and two small attacks. Then the last one is around. 7,000 times 4. So that is for hero. So let's just uh, fast forward this one and uh, move to um, Sikare. I don't know. To Arya. So same. Same. What do you call the Same routine. Sikare then pack. Then let's see the damage for Arya as well. I'll be showing you guys a, comp a chart comparison on how they did. And where are they going to be excelling? Well, we're, we're going to do it in a while. So, again, as you can see here, um, same data, same path, so that we won't deviate so much in terms of the result of uh, this test. So, for Arya, it's a 4936, so two big damages, uh, same, same damage. Then, four. Again, that's a big damage of 9,945. Um, the only the only reason why she is a big damage, of course, because of the buffer, the a, um, um, active skill. Hero, um, by the way, guys, um, if you if he pass if she passes through uh, enhanced styles, definitely damages go bigger. So, the the previous one that I did was was without an enhanced style because again, damage varies with enhanced style. So with hero, you have to you know, um, best if um, you have other um, Aurorians that can give enhanced style. So that is where hero shines the most. So but we'll just. Do this with um, their, their their basic bonuses in terms of what they give to themselves only in terms of um, active skill. So there you go. That's 9,000 times 4. For Arya, let's move on to... Let's just fast forward this to... There you go. So also for Barton, you have to do his active skill to increase damage and range. For chain combo, that's for chain combo. So let's do the same path again for him. So for Barton, he will deal one big and one small damage. By the way, my Barton is only at BT3 and uh, level 5 for affinity. I'll show you guys the comparisons of how they're leveled up in a while. So let's just finish this. Okay, so 
as you can see there that's 9822 that's only for combo that's for chain combo damage at max chain combo damage so those are the the tests that i was able to perform for all three of them and let us see the chart that um that's just to make a comparison on how they did okay so this is the hero versus aria versus barton chart so we're gonna be going through how they're leveled up so the only difference here hero and aria are at the uh, max breakthrough barton is at breakthrough three because i just wanted his um his um uh, breakthrough three because of the 20 loan loan points or something so that he can use it in the first turn for the buff for his chain combo so that's very important so take barton to bt3 then his affinity is at level five so not yet at level uh what they call this not yet at, le at max level so that is the difference um normal attack again for a hero it's a one big two small attack for Arya, it's two big attacks and uh, Barton Deathblades is one big and one small. So take note that this sample attack is based on a four tiled boss sample. Okay, so if you rank that, um, Hero is uh, number one. Then Arya is going to be second. And Barton is going to be, uh, what do you call this? uh third in terms of normal attack so normal attack hits as you can see hero has three hits for a four tile boss so definitely if it's a bigger boss she will hit more tiles because of her multiple hits in one in multiple hits in one normal attack so she has the advantage here so again hero is um ranked one here tied uh also uh is Arya and barton for your normal attack so definitely hero wins the battle of the normal attacks bigger damage for her for your chain combo all of them are at um four hits for four four tiled um boss they're, they're tied they're all tied in um, their ranking chain combo total damage these are the actual chain combo damage that they dealt for the four attacks so this is just a this amount will definitely vary especially if um barton was already leveled up and maxed up for everything so as you can see here chain combo hero does not really excel that much then Arya is top here, rank. I'm just gonna change this one. Hero. Arya. Arya. And second is Barton. Or rank three. Okay, so, but again, Barton's chain combo damage is set to increase. He's not really at maxed and um he has very high potential for massive damage for chain combo only okay so these are his um sorry these are their um chain go chain combo damage output so chain 2 chain 8 chain 12 chain 13 so Arya and hero are more or less the same so 160 165 170 the multiplier for barton is actually insane especially if in the lone state so um the 160 is the non-lone state the 170 is the lone state so uh left and right they are changing so 170 190 then the last one at chain 13 it's at 180 210 ridiculous damage especially if you reach uh chain 30 uh, chain thir chain 13 okay so this one so both of them are tied so aria and um this this is not gonna fit well with uh with the labeling up there but again in terms of chain aria and hero are tied in terms of damage output but 
Spartan is definitely going to be your number one output, uh, uh, number one damage dealer in terms of output when you try to compute for chain combo damage. Okay, so again, we're going to be going through the final thoughts down there. So damage focus, um, hero will be based on basic attack. Dealing more damage with basic attack with multi tiles, especially with bigger bosses, multi tiled bosses, she's gonna deal damage with her basic attack. While for um, Arya here, for Arya, you're gonna be doing a basic attack and chain combo. She's gonna excel there, but with a lesser area um, of damage. Okay, take note, she is actually at, uh, a, she is a 5-star Aurorian. And for Barton, of course, um, he's going to be a chain combo damage dealer and also multi-tile. So, he's one of, um, he, he's really going to deal damage with his chain combo, especially if you have multi-tiles because his reach, his area of damage is actually pretty much wide. So, that is why... Chain combo is his go his is his specialty in terms of damage dealing. Okay, just uh, other you know other you know other things to consider when you are going to be selecting them for what stage, at what part of the game you are in. Other skills for hero is going to be direct damage for attack skill. Sorry, active skill. So again, uh, she deals damage, enhanced style, damage enhancement. The more enhanced style she goes through, the bigger damage she's going to deal. She also has tile conversion for Arya um, attacks that buff for um, active skills. So attack, but there's going to be an attack and defense penalty for the next round. So this is going to be a bummer for her. Um, this used to be negligible, but right now with Barton coming up, this is, this is going to be so glaring in terms of doing damage for the second round, because again, she will have a attack and defense penalty. Um, but she has, um, crowd control, um, auto kills with, uh, HP, uh, enemies HP lower than 1.5 over attack. And she also has damage penetration. And for Barton, increase weapon reach and chain combo damage for the active skill. So this actually makes him good for tightly clustered enemies, whether it be one tile or four tiles or bosses. He is going to be dealing a lot of damage uh, with his chain combo. Oh, attack in diagonal tiles, which gives him more attack. Uh, again, perfect for, you know, for dealing, dealing more damage again. So equipment has a large splash damage area. Okay, pros for all of them. Hero is going to definitely be your best all-around detonator with damage, um, tile conversion, Direct damage for the attack skill. For Arya, um, sorry, for, for Hero, the other one is best multi-tile boss killer. More tiles, the better. So if a boss is with a multi is a multi-tile boss, more than four, then definitely Hero is going to shine here because one normal attack, if for example you you attack along the lines of the boss. Um, she will deal more da uh, damage and the more tiles, the better. Uh, for Arya, cluster of single tile and four tile enemies. She's going to you know excel at that, but she has a smaller range. And she is the best five-star detonator for forest right now. So if you're starting out, if you are, you know, if you're starting building your team, it's okay if, um, if you don't have Barton. Arya will definitely be um, more than enough um, damage dealing for a detonator as your second detonator, by the way. Next is going to be Barton. So cluster of single tile and four tile enemies. She's going to be, uh, he's going to be very good at this one. And best chain combo damage output, dam best chain combo damage dealer output. Am I right? Um, anyway, but that is actually his um, skill. So 
chain combo is going to be his selling point when you use him not so much for a normal attack going going towards dealing that chain combo um really really he's a lawnmower for me what he does and how he does it um is really a good lawnmower in terms of your enemies and cons by the way so i don't think i see any cons for hero at this point um he she doesn't need to be um her preemptive strike is available in bt3 so that is actually very good for value for Arya, has to be buffed by a, by active skill to deal great damage that is the problem with her um that's the only con that she has and but again for her five star you know she, she's easier to level up she's easier to break through because she's five star but again the active skill sometimes if you need more consistent damage she cannot put that out on the second round and last is barton deft blades i don't see at this point i don't see any drawback for him um probably just now because he's new he's harder to get that's just it but overall i don't see any problem with this kit um solid chain combo damage dealer um and good actually a uh, normal damage dealer so again i still have to max him out in the future max breakthrough max affinity and we'll see we'll, we'll try to compare by that time if he really really is way above and beyond of Arya. but at this point i will say that um barton if you don't max him out, he's really um, at par with Arya. Just a little bit higher. Just a little bit higher. But if you max break through him, he's going to be second. He's not going to be first for me because of the utility that, uh, that Hero gives. And uh, being versatile is actually you know important in, in Alchemy Stars versatility of units because again if you take on versatile or multiple roles then you're more valued as an aurorian so that is it so again ranking would be hero first second would be barton third would be Arya definitely because barton is on his way up so that is it guys so hopefully you were able to um you know appreciate this one took me a while to build this chart i will be doing another analysis of uh, reinhardt in terms of damage with the same format and this one i will be sharing this in the description so that you could have access to this so that you can review this and probably have some comments um, in this video what you think of this assessment and what you think of these aurorians Am I ranking them correctly? Do you have any other thoughts? Put them down in the comment section below. So thank you guys for staying this far. So hopefully you're still here. Um, and please do subscribe to my channel because this really helps my channel a lot. Thank you guys. Stay safe. Take care. This is The Warden and I'm out of here.